guys, so I will show you a 51 gram protein shake just using protein powder, collagen, peanut butter, and spirulina. All right, so let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is put in two scoops of protein powder. I'm using uh, organic protein. Uh, I, don't, I don't really use too many protein powders. I just started doing that as well. So this is just the first one that I bought and it has good ingredients in it. And two. All right, that is done. Then we're gonna put our collagen in. And for this, we're also using two scoops. So the reason why collagen is, is so good for you is, um, again, it's another protein that you can use in your body. It's also really good for your skin, your hair, your nails. Um, all of that. So it's also a really good reason to put that in there as well. Plus, extra protein. All right, now we got spirulina. So spirulina might smell like fish food, but it's good for you. And it makes your shape green, so I don't mind it. Now we have two scoops of peanut butter. So peanut butter actually has a lot of protein in it. I think it's eight grams of protein per two tablespoons. So we get another eight grams in there. that is in our shake. Then we're gonna put in some creatine because after a workout, you wanna make sure you put creatine in. It will just help you recover a little bit faster. Uh, it help you build a little bit more muscle. It's one of the most studied uh, supplements you can take, so it's very, very proven to help. And then finally, we have some water. All right, and now we're gonna put some ice in there. Put some ice in there and then some water. You can put um, coconut milk, uh, almond milk, just right now I don't have any of that right now, so water will do. Alright guys, so that is how you make a 51 gram protein shake. Now I would suggest getting a uh, plant-based protein just because I think whey has a little more um, side effects to it that don't help with weight loss as much. So try to get a plant-based protein if you like any of them. Um, check out the collagen, especially for um, healthy hair, healthy nails, healthy skin, as well as extra protein. Uh, some people always, almost always have peanut butter, so you can always put that in there. And then check out spirulina. It has a lot of good antioxidant in there, antioxidants, and it's really good for your immune system. So uh, I'll see you next video. Thank you very much.